We just purchased two items that seem to be specimens of human abnormality, which is exactly what our customer is looking for. We're not 100% sure exactly what these are, so we're taking it to a friend who's sure to know. Hey, Nicole. How's it going? Hey, what's up? How are you? Hey, how are you? This is Evan. Hey, nice to so meet you. So pleased to meet you. I'm the lead pathologist assistant at Thomas Jefferson University Hospital. I love gross anatomy, deformed organs, cancer, tumors, infections, anything like that. A customer came into the shop the other day looking for an anatomical specimen, something that's been deformed by disease. And we found these pieces here. Okay. There's something wrong with them. We couldn't determine if it was disease or trauma. We we're a little confused about that, which is why we're here. All right, cool. Hopefully we could tell them something about yeah. it. Yeah. This is the first thing we found. We thought maybe you could tell what this was. Cool. Yeah. Tell us what you think. Well, I definitely don't think that it's disease. I don't see any tumor growth. I don't mm -hmm. see any carious bone here, which you would see in like syphilis or something right, like exactly. that. If you look here, you could see some splintering around the margin here, which mm -hmm. may indicate that this was a, some kind of a fracture due to blunt force trauma or mm -hmm. something, which is kind of cool, actually. But there's I definitely mean, no pathology. But there's in definitely your... no pathology. They I mean... can't all be terminal. <laughs> This is the item we're a little more interested in. I think you'll like this one. There's clearly yeah. something going on in here. We're just not sure what. Ooh. I'll love this one. Let's see. Obviously, right here, you see that there's normal kind of bones. Mm -hmm. And then this bone right here looks like it's totally obliterated. There's definitely something odd going on here. So I'd actually like to show one of our bone specialists this mm -hmm. for it because I'll be able to give you a more definitive answer. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Nicole. Very important. Talk to you soon. Okay, cool.